The signs and symptoms that we see in our patient with heart failure have everything to do with which side of the heart is actually experiencing failure. Now the job of the left side of the heart is to take that blood that's coming back from the lungs and then push it out into the body. So if it's unable to take that blood from the lungs and push it out into the body, we're gonna see this back up into the lungs. Our patient's gonna have, have struggles breathing, right? They're gonna have gas exchange problems, hypoxia, and they're gonna have a decreased SpO2. Um, but the big thing to keep in mind here, right, is we're gonna have this pulmonary congestion. That's gonna come out as pulmonary edema, and uh, we're gonna be able to hear this uh, as we assess our patient. When they cough, they might have this frothy sputum uh, coming out. And they might also experience orthopnea, which is this difficulty breathing when they lie down. Now, their lungs are full of fluid. So imagine how difficult it would be to breathe when you lie down. If you're looking to expand your knowledge about the cardiovascular system and cardiovascular pharmacology, head over to nursing.com slash heart, where you can take quizzes to see where you stand, download cheat sheets, and watch videos by experienced and practicing nurses on this information. Go out and be your best self today. Happy nursing.